on the last video. Hey guys, just interrupting the video to keep you updated on a couple of things. This video has some different audio settings, and some of the future videos will have some different editing things. Please feel free to let me know what you think about these in the comments, and follow me on Twitch, which is where all these videos are streamed originally. Thanks, and enjoy the video. This Albion Clan Kelly business leaves a bad taste in my mouth. And if Caitlin Lau's right, then this little nugget jumps to the front of the queue. We have reason to believe a former DedSec operative may still be alive, but missing inside the EPC. Angel Lopez, not London Thorn, but I won't hold that against him, unlike some others. Looks like Angel got caught up in the immigration roundup, which, ironically, may be the only reason he escaped Zero Day's dead sec purge. Anti-immigrant sentiment has grown in London since the bombings. Albion fuels it. It allows them to send anyone they want to their brutal refugee camp. We need to find Angel before they discover he's dead sec. This is kind of personal team. But finding his trail might just shed some light on the Albion Clan Kelly connection. That's not good. No deportees are leaving the UK. They probably threw him into the EPC and just forgot about him. I've sent the details to your device and advised our contact at the EPC. They can get you inside. We have this to do. Meet contact at the EPC. Okay. Cool. We'll go around and we'll do these. Hopefully this evidence I can actually photograph. Like, oh, Kennington. I want to say this is the borough that Sanford Bridge is in. So, I've delved more into Caitlin Lau's investigation and an enormous number of missing person cases center around the EPC. The inspector was definitely onto something. Okay, yeah, let's find our guy. If they work out that Angel is dead sec before we find him, he's, you know, dead. We'll do that here in a second. How do I photograph it? Does that work? Is that someone's hand? Ugh. Alright. Okay. I could put something here. Nice. Nice. Not just anyone could heroically vandalize a hospital, but you're not just anyone, are you? The people of Lambeth are sure to love this. Well done. Could be a good spot to get dead sex message out. There you go. Oh, nice. I just deleted it. It's done. You're done so far as the Imperial War Museum is concerned, but a little less Albion propaganda in Lambeth will go a long way. There we go. Sorry, what? Seems Albion has a surveillance network in Lambeth that makes 1980s East Germany look like present day East Germany. I'm sure the people of Lambeth will be interested to know just how closely they are being watched. Ah, oh, now we got a new mission. Cool. We've taken care of every Albion target we had in Lambeth. Brilliant. The people have had enough of Albion and are ready to show it. One brave soul has asked to meet to discuss how to rally the borough. Are you blind? You can't see me! Got back in summons. I've already taken care of your entry. Get you in quick and quiet. This is off the record, right? I don't need them knowing we're here. No worries, I'll spoke. But come meet me on the rooftop. The only place here that doesn't smell like piss. Got some info for you. The European Processing Center. It processes deportees by stacking them up in squalid conditions and forgetting about them. But hey, it's to protect London, right? Oh, <gasps> we can get sloshed and throw darts. Beer and darts! Yeah. What's going on here? This place is worse than a prison camp. Every day I see people come through here torn from their homes and their families. But I'd rather stay and keep our eye on things. 
Maybe how about once in a while? Like, no. This is all so wrong. How is the government gonna go on treating people like animals? You could disappear and no one even notice. Yeah, well, people have been disappearing. Records say they have been processed, but it doesn't add up. No one ever properly leaves. And with the Kellys prowling around like fucking hyenas, I am not too optimistic about the people slipping through the cracks. As expected, if there's trouble, that damn Mary Kelly has to be involved. True. Now, about your missing guy, the best place to start would be the EPC database. They keep a record of everyone that comes in. And be careful. Tell me you found something. I have. His file has been deleted from the main database, along with hundreds of others. Still very detailed. Even when committing crimes against humanity, the government doesn't skip on paperwork. Here is a recording labeled Exit Interview. You know what we do with terrorists, Lopez? Ah, uh, don't go pissing me off by denying anything. We know you're with DedSec. You think you were picked up on some random sweep? Not a fucking chance. Nothing to say. Hmm. Well, this is not gonna go well for you then, because I want information. The rest of your cell, where are they? I want names, places, everything you've got. You think I'm daft? I spill everything I know and what? You let me go? I'm not talking. I know how this ends. Oh, I don't think you do. I'm going to throw you to the wolves. The Kellys have an interesting way of disposing with problems. You think I'm scared of some fucking thugs? Of winding up floating in the dams? Fuck you. You're too pretty for that, mate. <laughs> First, they'll peddle you. For Dosh, right? Then, when you're used up, they're going to chop you up and send the pieces to the four corners. I can take whatever you've got. I almost feel sorry for you. Get him to the bloody clinic, then. Shit. They knew he was dead sick the whole time. This doesn't look good for Angel. The clinic keeps government service hours, which means it's closed. We'll have to find Angel the old-fashioned way and hack their CTOS up. All right, cool. Deportation limbo, horrible living conditions, unexplained disappearances. It's almost as if the media are deliberately ignoring the situation here in favor of... Oh, look here, Beatrice Stokely, 89, recently took up kickboxing to fill up her days. Fascinating. If the EPC is a typical example of how humans treat each other, I'd say a benevolent AI overlord is a step up. Oh. You? Next time I see you, it's a factory reset. I have reconstructed an AR scene of Angel's examination. You can view it inside the clinic. Well done. All right. Oi. Fuck, what was that? Looks like they implanted him with something. We need to get closer. <laughs> Me not knowing my, my lefts and my rights properly. Facial analysis matches for both. They're part of Mary Kelly's little pack. So, Inspector Lau was right after all. Clank Kelly and Albion are in bed together. What a shit orty that would be. <laughs> Microchips, coated with biocompatible glass to prevent rejection. And pharmaceutically jammed right into Angel's neck. Question is, why? GPS? RFID? No, these are more sophisticated. If I had to guess, I would say they were designed to deliver a dose of some unknown compound. Not the kind of thing you find at your local corner shop. I could reconstruct the path he took if you want to see how this cliffhanger gets resolved. Keep on him. He might have made it out. Fuck! This 
Kill away! Get after him! Shit, they're catching up on him. Come on, Angel. He might just make it. That's not good. Huh. Okay, that chip was more than just a tracking device. Looks like it's been activated. I don't know how bad things are, especially if Mary Kelly is, but Angel might be alive. We need to find him, see what they did to him, and what that fucking microchip is all about. Seems like advanced technology for Mary Kelly and her band of thugs to be waving around. Could Mary be part of a scary dark web hacker group like, say, oh, I don't know, pick one, Zero Day? Interesting theory, Bagley, but hold your investigation algorithms for the moment, will you? Angel needs us. The incinerator they mentioned is probably the Southern incinerator. It's practically right around the corner. Okay, we've done that mission. You're one of them dead sick types been giving Albion the pain, right? People in the borough have noticed. That's why I rang you. Figured you'd be interested in giving them one more good swift kick in the bollocks. Go on. Them Albion twats have turned one of the city's landmarks into a fucking propaganda machine, and it ain't sitting well with the natives. The eye, well, it's a symbol of London, isn't it? A symbol for the people. Public, accessible, in the heart of London. But Albion have stamped their mark on the bloody thing. The only thing we see when we look at it now is a symbol of our oppression. Shows it plain to the world, too. Bloody drain on the people's morale. We're getting rather practiced at disrupting Albion propaganda. Leave it to us. You have to knock out some electronic security first. And for that, you'll need a little summit from one of them barges on the river. Which means clearing the defenses on the barge first, of course. But that's a doddle for the likes of you, right? I'll try. No promises. Doddle. <laughs> Alright. Translator. So it's a semi-auto shotgun. Jeez, all right. Well, this is exciting. The console on this barge is a control hub for prototype counter-terrorism drones. You can use one to destroy electronic Auto security measures on the wheel. Available. Okay. Compliance is mandatory. Disobedience will be met with force. Oh, this thing's... Cool. Prototype CT drones I've seen. So have fun with these while they last. And I can't imagine Albion will just let you fuck about with their most expensive toys. So be ready for some kind of response. Oh, yep, yeah, that's. Those are missiles. I'm digging this thing. That works. I was such a bad shot. Hello? Hey there. Don't mess with me. That's the last of them. You just need to complete a data 
transfer. Upload a more positive message for the people. Okay, we can do that. Oh, hello. We're caught in the wires. This is taking forever, dude. I'm really bad at this. This whole like fending off. There, I did it, I did it, I did it, I did it, I did it. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Got Lambda done. Which means you see all of those. And we get a chance to recruit a special yeah, member. That's a beautiful sight. I think I'm getting teary eyed over here, seeing the wheel the way it should be. I won't be the only one either. It may be tacky, but it's ours. Frankly, I'm glad to have Albion's stink washed off it. You just said a mouthful, and I doubt the borough would have woke up without you giving us the kick up the arse we needed. Thanks, Deadsec. Good. This is going to ignite the people's hopes in Lambeth, team. Albion's going to find it impossible to keep this borough under control. That's a feather in our cap. Nice. Where the Kellys took Angel. Jesus Christ, the poor fucker. Now, now, keep your chin up. We'll find him. There's a camera network that might have caught where they took him. Well, don't go that way. I tried warning you. To be fair, I really did. Ah, this dead sex shit's fun. Is your name Fergus? Sorry, but that's a gross name, dude. Fergus? Your parents did you dirty, my guy. Sorry if your name is actually Fergus in real life, but that's that's a big L. I've gone over the captured footage. I was able to follow Mr. Lopez down to the cellar, but then I ran out of cameras. Not a problem you often have in London. That's the move then. Alright, to the cellar we go. My oh my, Deadbolt Trump's technology. The door is sealed, but this rubbish shoot might do. It either leads to the cellar or your grisly death. Or both, I suppose. Grant. Just Grant. Cool. We're going through a trash shoot. Ow. Those are bodies. Oh. <laughs> e. <laughs> 
Okay. Big up, Katie. All right then. Come on out. I'm not gonna cut you. Big up, Katie. A. All right then. Sup, my guy. Thanks for the distraction. Gave me the second I needed to take care of this filth. Jesus, you are right. He was about to carve you up like a Sunday roast. He was. I'm fine. I just need a second to catch my breath and find my files. Hold on. You're Caitlin Lau. Police suspect that Caitlin Lau, right? We found your video logs. You went after Bloody Mary all by yourself. Very impressive. I wasn't always on my own. Who the hell are you? You're dead sick, aren't you? Oh. You tracked me to the slaughterhouse. I wish you could say we did. A friend of ours disappeared from the EPC. The trail led here. To this abomination. I was saying some dark shit, but this... Then I'm sorry. I don't think there's much hope for finding him alive. The Kellys have got a sick little operation going. A kind of... human organ black market. I've been investigating them for months. And they got my fucking files. God, I feel like shit. You should rest. Tell you what, we can get you somewhere safe. Short term, no strings. In the meantime, I'll find Angel in your files. They sound important. Everything I've gathered on Mary Kelly. Almost enough to take her down. Grant. After all this, Dead Sec will be having a closer look at Mary fucking Kelly. Could use all the help we can get. All right. All right, an operative is on their way to escort Inspector Lau. So, let's find Angel and inspect Lau's files. There's no doubt about it, this whole operation is meant to harvest organs. Clan Kelly's chopping off the parts they want and burning the leftovers. Well, I go out on a limb and guess that none of these people volunteered to be donors. Fuck me. Look at these poor bastards. You can't tell one from the other. Bagley, any ideas? Take a picture and I can run key details past various databases. Negative. How can anyone treat another human being this way? How many has Clan Kelly done this to? We have to end it. Agreed. Unfortunately, I must confirm that this is indeed Angel Lopez. Shit. Angel. He knew the risks. I did too, but... Never thought DedSec would get caught up in this. Mary Kelly is preying on London's most vulnerable. She's a fucking monster. Taking her out needs to be a dead sec priority. Now we need to find Caitlin Lau's case files on Mary Kelly. See if my conjecture may be correct. Could Mary Kelly be in zero day? Well, got the files. The inspector will be impressed. Now get out of here before someone decides to turn you into minced meat. Chop, chop. Not Good kidding. idea. Dead sec. Caitlin Lau here. I uh, wanted to thank you. I'd be nothing but an anatomy lesson by now. Or a pile of ashes. You'll be happy to know that Inspector Lau has been escorted to a nearby refuge and is getting her wounds treated. I'll be fine. Still a little flighty from whatever they gave me. And frankly, a little stunned that we've joined forces. Damn. Never thought Dead Sec would partner up with a cop. Or, well, an ex cop even, but. I'm glad. Whatever it takes to stop Mary Kelly from doing this shit to others. Exactly. You have an organization. I have information and some backing from powerful people. Pool our resources and we might just take her down. Mary Kelly's no petty criminal. Bagley, I can't just decide what to do with these foils in the field. Let's get everyone together. I'll sync with Inspector Lau and prepare a briefing. Cool. <laughs> 